Hi guys, and welcome to how to use Zoom on a Mac. So the first video I did was how to install it. Uh, if you haven't done that yet, uh, click below in the show description and I'll have a link to that video. Uh, but now that you have uh, Zoom on your Mac, uh, you're going to go to, I'm just going to go Command Spacebar and bring up, you can type in Zoom and it'll show up. Uh, but we're just going to double click zoom.us and this will quickly open up. Another way you can start Zoom up is by going to your launch pad, left clicking, and then if you've loaded Zoom on there, it should be in here. So zoom.us. That's a second way to get in. This is great software, by the way, for multiple people to, uh, to do business and work, um, to do a sales presentation, or just hang out with friends. But I am gonna start this thing. We're gonna add uh, my daughter, and we're gonna add, uh, I have a PC. Um, so I'm gonna go to new meeting, left click it, there I am, and I'm gonna join with computer audio. You can also test your speaker and microphone at this stage. Uh, okay, so I'll join, and now I'm just gonna go full screen. All right, and everything is working fine. I'm good to go here. I'm gonna click participants, left click it, and I'm just gonna push this off to the side here, and I'm gonna go invite, left click it. And now we have the code at the top of the screen. It says invite people to join meeting and then the code. Um, so I have to tell people uh, via uh, email or I can text them. Uh, I can send an email with the codes and the password down below here is meeting password. They need that as well. My daughter Ella is behind me so I am going to input this code Ella. So put 741-967-8438. Now on the PC, I'm gonna do the exact same thing. So I would just text this to my friend or my coworker. We are at 741-967-84387. Now they can go to um, join a meeting at zoom.us uh, forward slash join. Um, if they have the code, they should be able to join it and they just click join. They don't even have to have the software on there, I don't think. Um, Okay, so I am clicking it. Open Zoom meetings. It is asking me on the PC. And it says launching. Now you do the same, but it's safe. Oh, you didn't have the whole code in there? Oh yeah. Hmm. What about if we do it on an iPad? Okay, go grab the iPad. Okay, so on the PC it's asking me for the meeting password. So I'm gonna enter that. It looks like it's cap sensitive, so it's a big U. T4Y. Now I'm going to click join meeting on the PC. Now my webcam is working here. You guys will be able to see me from a different view here. So I'm going to say join with video or you can join without video and just watch. So I'm going to click join with video and now um, it's asking me if I want to admit them to our meeting. So I'll say admit. It's in the top right hand corner here. Admit. And then it's connecting on the PC now. There we go. So now we can see myself from two different angles. So this is another friend and we're both on the same screen. And if we weren't in the same room, uh, I would add the audio from there, but we might get feedback, I'm thinking. So the next trick is, can we now get Ella in on her iPad? Here, bring this here. Oh yeah, there she is there on join a meeting. I don't know if you can see that. Um, so we're gonna type in the meeting password on there. Join on there with the code in it. It'll ask for the password at that point. Safari can't open because address is invalid. Okay, we're gonna tap, we're gonna go to the App Store and say get, and we'll install it. Okay, it is now downloading. It says Zoom Cloud Meetings. And I'll show the scammer too. <laughs> this is weird. Okay, it's like that mirror within the mirror within the mirror. All right, so once this is up and going, we're gonna hand it off to my daughter, Ella, and we're gonna have three people on the screen. Two of me, where it only needs one of me, but we're gonna get two of me and uh, one of Ella. Now this is, says open, we're gonna tap that and join a meeting, and we're gonna put the meeting code in again, yet again, join. Then it should ask for the password, and it did. Okay, so we're gonna input the password that's, okay, Zoom is gonna ask the iPad, would you like to access the camera? Uh, join with video, or you could join without. Now I have, because I set up the meeting, um, you don't want to get Zoom bombed, uh, so you uh, give them permission. I'm going to say admit, 
and it wants access to my microphone. I'll say, don't allow that. Okay, let's give that to Ella now. To hear others, please join audio. Uh, we won't worry about the audio right now, but let's hand that off to Ella. There, okay, so exit full screen, I can see Ella. Can you wave to us up there, buddy? There she is there, so she is watching in on the meeting. And uh, I'm gonna click off that. And so potentially we have a conversation with, um, with three people at this point. Um, also, you can share your screen. So I'm gonna share my screen here, that green button. And I can share my uh, Google. Um, I can do a whiteboard, let's try that. And this I can do a squiggly. Um, I can type and uh, all sorts of fun stuff. So we can communicate um, very easily. Um, let's go to share screen again. And we're gonna go, uh, da, 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 da. we'll go to my, what I have up here. I've got a good dad, rich dad, poor dad here. Um, and I'm sharing my screen. Can you see my screen, Ella? Yeah, so she can see my screen on there. I can see it on, on the PC as well. Um, but yeah, so we can share screens, we can draw on the sketchboard, we can talk, and you just have to share the meeting, and they don't even need, I believe, Zoom on their computer, just the, they can do it within the browser. Yeah, so if you guys have any questions, that's sort of the basics of how to use it. Um, and then let's maybe, to end the call, I'm just going to bring up my stuff here. Let's see. I'll say stop share up here at the top. That stopped sharing the screen. Uh, Ella, wave one more time. <laughs> Thanks for so much for helping. Um, and over here on the right-hand side, I am going to... I still have some controls. I can mute all, unmute all. Um, but I can now uh, end this thing. Stop video. End meeting. End meeting for all or leave meeting. I'm going to say end meeting for all. Also, from this screen, you can also chat. Uh, with your contacts, which is the fourth icon from the top. And you can uh, have your favorites in here. You can text, you could text people the meeting ID, and you can also text them the password. So on the meetings tab up here, left click it, and you can schedule a meeting. And here's the code here. And send it off to everyone before your meeting starts. If you hit chat here, you can also go to the apps. We're going to hit this plus sign. And here's a lot of extra features that you can add to your Zoom software. So if you guys use incoming webhook or Google Calendar notification, you can integrate it with Zoom. Here's Gyro notifications, Trello, Wikipedia search, Evernote, Zendesk notifications, Pipedream, GitHub, GitLab, Twitter, Jenkins, Adobe Creative Cloud, that could be useful for me. Um, actually, let's click that. Actually, we'll go over the rest of the list here and then I'm gonna click Adobe Creative Cloud. Qualtrics, Pipedream, ServiceNow, Asanya, DocuSign, I could use that as well. SurveyMonkey, Monday.com notifications. So I'm gonna kick, click Adobe Creative Cloud here. So here it is here. I maybe won't do it right now. Um, so if you were working on a, uh, perhaps editing a movie and you're wor working on certain sections, um, you could perhaps share titles and graphics uh, between the group. So also at the bottom of the screen, you have, you can record the screen and you also have reactions like a thumbs up and a clap. In your share screen drop up, it looks like, one participant can share at a time where multiple participants can share the screen at the same time. Let's go to advanced sharing options. So who can share? Only the host. So it can only be you if you started the meeting, or you can have all participants able to share their screen. Who can start sharing when someone else is sharing? So this just gives you controls to manage your meeting. Again, chat. You can chat with anyone in the group, and it'll be over here on the right-hand side. So as people are added, you can uh, type hi to everyone. Hi guys, and welcome to the meeting. And if they're in there, they can 
chat back and forth. You can add files as well. In the bottom right hand corner, just click that and you can go to certain spots on your computer and share files. Let's click this. So participant can chat with no one, host only, everyone publicly, everyone publicly and privately. And you can also save your chat so you have a record of it. So you can add up to 100 participants by default in every meeting, up to 500 with large meeting add-on. You can host an unlimited number of meetings, but if you'd like to have more than one meeting concurrently, you will need additional host licenses. Let's go to the plan and pricing. So the free account basic, uh, which we've done in the first video, again, hosts up to 100 participants, unlimited one-to-one -one meetings, 40 minute limit on group meetings. Let's click that there. Zoom offers a full featured basic plan for free with unlimited meetings. Try Zoom for as long as you'd like. There's no trial period. Your basic plan has a 40 minute time limit on meetings with three or more total participants. Need your group meetings to last longer than 40 minutes? Well, sign up for a pro account. Okay guys, so that's the uh, how to use Zoom on a Mac. It's fantastic software. If you guys have any questions, please uh, comment below and don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that bell and uh, I'll do more videos if you want me to do it. Um, I'd love to do a, a with like 10 people. Um, you can play Dungeons and Dragons with it. You can have business meetings, sales meetings, uh, have a drink with your, your friends while we're, uh, we're all indoors. Um, anyways, guys, uh, thanks so much for watching and I will talk to you guys soon. Cheers. Bye.